makes a hell of a lot more sense to me that there is a damn jellyfish world out there, and there is a baboon world out there, and there is a spider world out there, and there's some that are spider heavy and have some baboons, and maybe there's some that baboon, you know, that, that and we're a zoo. We're a zoo of life, right. not necessarily a unique one by any means, but some planets might be tilted more towards one kind of thing. It might be more insecty, and another one might be more mammals, and so on and so forth, and that that soup is constantly coming in. And, you know, here's the greatest thing about that paper. Okay, so then the Russians, and I kept looking, I, somehow I missed it, but I'm like, God, this is going to make worldwide news. We finally discovered life in space. And because it was reported, plankton found on outside of space station, and then psh, nothing. Crickets, just like always, on the really important stuff. They said, we've only got two choices here, the Russians did. They said either it came from above or we it came from below. Well, first of all, if that mechanism is true, it means life's everywhere. It means we're seeding life. 